bringing out and showing you. And what Kyrie Irving proved to all of us these past two weeks, that black men in America are not free. You are not free to believe what you want to believe. You are not free to be who you want to be. I thought we lived in America. I thought we had freedom of speech in America. I thought you could be whatever you want to be. And then what the kindergarten teacher told you in class, they told you you can, you can grow up and you can be whatever you want to be, except for a Jew if you're black. If you're a Jew, you can't. And if you're black, you can't be a Jew. You can't do that thing, but you can be everything else. In America, you can do literally anything. In America, you can have orgies and lose sex. In America, a man can become a woman. In America, a woman can, can become a man. And everybody accepts it. Everybody goes right along with it, and those people are praised. But as soon as a black man decides to claim his identity, he's shunned. He's canceled. He might get fired. He might lose, lose his endorsements. Because black men are spending, man, that's what really matters. Money doesn't matter. Money doesn't matter. Being a, being a good uh, uh, record producer like Kanye West doesn't matter. Being able to bounce a basketball does not matter. Your identity is what matters. Your identity is what gives you true power and authority on the planet Earth. And these Jewish people know it. These Jewish people know that, that right now, today, they're God's chosen people. Right now, they should rule the Earth. Right now, they have claim to it, according to the Bible. But, and they're gonna, and they, they will refuse to let us take our rightful claim over this earth. Black man, black man, the, the, the most high gave you, gave you more than a basketball contract. The, the most high gave you more than, than an endorsement with, 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 with Adidas and Nike. The most high gave you rulership over the planet Earth. So what do you want to do to you? What do you want to do to get it? Are you want to give up endorsements? Are you want to, are you want to get, give up a record contract? Are you willing to give up everything that this world has to offer you for what God has to offer you? And that's what we're giving you in the eyes should be king. We are giving you your true identity. Right. What, what, what Kyrie Irving did, it was a small thing. It was a small thing in the eyes of men like us. But, but on, the grand, on, on, on the main stage, it was amazing. Because he did a small thing that opened up the millions of eyes to, to what is the true reality here on this earth. And that is black people, Hispanics, and Native Indians are God's chosen people. Well, I'm going to grab one, uh, one scripture, uh, 2 Maccabees 6 and 6. 2 Maccabees 6 and 6 here in the apocrypha, the one. Once again, why, uh, what I don't understand is, why is what Kyrie Irving did so um, offensive? What he did is so offensive. The, 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 the documentary that he posted, Hebrews to Negroes, everybody is so upset. Uh, evidently, it, it, um, it upset millions of Jewish people. It hurt the feelings of Jewish, millions of Jewish people who never even watched the documentary. What are you offended by? Now, uh, we all know the vast majority of people who are upset about Kyrie Irving did not watch that documentary. Right. You didn't read the book. You don't know what's in it. You don't know what's in that documentary. But you do know the title. You do know the title said Hebrews to Negroes. Right. And that title, the, that, the, that phrase saying that black people are Israelites, that's offensive. That's offensive, offensive to Jewish people. That's offensive. That that's considered anti-Semitic. Simply taking on your own, own identity. Right. I, 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 I will never understand it. For the life of me, I would never understand how claiming our identity is hateful. How can me saying I'm a Jew be anti-Semitic? How can me, me, me saying I'm an Israelite be, be anti-Semitic? Well, well, once again, we share everything else. And, and Kyrie Irving said, yeah, I'm a woman. If Kyrie Irving said, yeah, I believe I'm a woman, and I'm going to go play for the WNBA. He will be in there next week. He'll, he'll, he'll be balling on women next week. If Kanye West said, yeah, I'm going to be a woman. I'm going to be I'm gonna be the first mainstream tra uh, transgender rapper. And you will go out, everybody will go out and buy his album. You can be everything in America as a black man. Anything except for, for the chosen people of God. And, and, and this thing that's going on right now is not new. It's been going on for thousands of years. They have always tried to suppress the true identity of the Israelite. Read the scripture right here. We're going to 2 Maccabees 6 and 6. 2 Maccabees chapter 6 verse 6. 2 Maccabees verse 6. Chapter 6 verse 6. Neither was it lawful for a man to keep Sabbath days or ancient feasts or to profess himself at all to be a Jew. Black man is man, man. Open up the book. Open up the book. Read about the Maccabees. Read about the Maccabees. The Maccabees, and the Maccabees, you read about how the Israelites were oppressed by the Greeks. Just like the Israelites or black people are oppressed by Americans today. And they made laws. 
and they put rules, the Greeks put laws and rules over the Israelites about what they could do and not do. And what was one of the things that an Israelite, a black man could not do even, even, even all the way back in, in, in the Greek empire? Read that from the top. It's the book of 2 Maccabees, chapter 2, verse 2. Neither was it lawful for a man to keep Sabbath days or ancient feasts or to profess himself at all to be a Jew. He was a black man. You couldn't keep the Passover in, in Greece. It, it was offensive. It was anti-Semitic uh, to, 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 to uh, follow the Passover. It was anti-Semitic to, to wear a shield of David or what you call a star of David. It was anti-Semitic to, to call yourself a Jew if you were a black man, and that was all the way back, in, back, 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 back with the Greeks. Read that one more time. This is the book of 2 Maccabees, chapter 6, verse 6. Neither was it lawful for a man to keep Sabbath days or ancient feasts or to profess himself at all to be a Jew. Black man, you are not allowed to profess yourself at all to be a Jew. Once again, that is the one thing you can be. That is the one thing that they refuse to give you because, they, because there is absolute power in taking on that identity. Yeah. It's absolute power in us waking up and realizing who we truly are. Because, because, because when we realize we truly are, maybe we won't just go, maybe, maybe we, won't, we won't support white record labels anymore. Maybe we, we won't support the NBA. Maybe, maybe we wake up and say, let's make our own NBA. Let's make our own black league. Let's support our own black record labels and make our own black, black shoe companies. The hell with Nike, the hell with Adidas, and that's the fear. The fear is that if we all wake up and decide that we are God's chosen people, that we are the Israelites, that, 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 we, that we will shun and cancel the mainstream and build something for ourselves. And, and that's the fear. Black man, Hispanic man, wake up. Realize that your identity is more important than a basketball contract. Your identity is more important than a record contract. And Kyrie Irving and Kyrie, Kyrie, Kyrie Irving and Kanye West, they understand that. There's something more important than money. There's something more important than the fame. What's more, more important is following the Most High, because the Most High can give you true power. The Most High can give you true power and authority over the planet Earth. Black man, Hispanic man, Native Indian man, Indian man take back your, your identity. Right. Take back your identity That's as right. an Israelite. And with that, Shalom. Trying to find something to follow Hand loyalty, every man tried to borrow Felt pain, and a lot of sorrow Got betrayed, so packed, I didn't even have my heart broke Living confused, about to lose hope Cops got me on the side of the road Like a sideshow, need an antidote before I croak Now I'm setting fire to rhythm man blues Call this guitar smoke Rebel with no cause, trying to find direction The world got me vexed Picked up a bad lick of habit that's already turned from oppression Felt like my life was on fire trying to find an exit Now look, 10 G's plus a good wreck Sometimes a follower is a soldier Trying to find a good ship Plus when you in hell, how do you excel? With them the breath of life, I don't believe in fairy tale Listen well to what I tell No call it can cause pain Something that a rebel knows very well Can't you tell I was sent from the Lord?